All right, let's move on to some keg <laughs> shopping news, some sad news that uh, apparently Toys R Us is indeed going to close all of its stores. Um, which, sad. Which is uh, going to affect up to 33,000 people. Oh. And yeah, they've been in business for 60 years. And yeah. It's it's pretty it's rough. It's, pretty rough. it's depressing. It is, it's, and it's going to impact like, toy companies apparently. Because I remember, totally. I mean, I remember reading an article just a couple months ago when they first announced when they first announced that they're declaring bankruptcy, uh, restructuring. The toy company they were saying that the toy companies rely on Toys R Us so much that they they would almost have to support the the store financially because that's how important it is to have that that store available to them. But I guess that wasn't true because it seems like they're. Oh, I mean, it's going to be a big hit on them, though. I yeah. Mean, I, I mean, there's only so much shelf space in Target and Walmart. Yep. That's, I mean, that's part of it. That, you know, there's Target and Especially Walmart. Target, like really- Walmart's going to be the de facto, like, they're going to pick up as much of this Toys R Us as possible. See, yeah, it's funny because I think it would be the other way around. At least in our area, I think it's going to be more Target than Walmart. Well, Target doesn't have as much like square footage for toys though as as Walmart does. Oh, on mine, it's like a third of the store. Hmm. Oh, it does In say Target, it, it does say it's, go- it's one third if it is toys. It says a group of toy makers uh, led by the company. What are the other two thirds of your Target? I'm I'm confused. It's one third toys, one uh-huh. third clothes, one uh-huh. third groceries. Okay, so no no electronics. Oh yeah, that's true. There's a, there's like a corner of electronics. No, no pharmaceuticals. Uh there is a pharmacy. You're right. No, is. no home goods. The pharmacy is like its own separate thing because it's not like in the square footage of the store. You have to like go to a separate area. So I don't count that. And no, that's I don't think there's a photos. No, no home goods. No. Oh, home goods. No that, towels. That's no with like the the bedding. grocery section. What? No, it's not. Kitchen, Wombat's kitchen living in a fantasy gear. target. Fine. <laughs> no, think no, of it like of here, you know what? Think of it like a giant. Seasonal? Think of it like a giant letter E. And then there's the one line that would have the home goods, which isn't that big. So it's not as long as the three lines of the E. And the three lines of the E, one of them is like toys and, and crafts. That's one big line. <laughs> then there's another big line that's clothes, and then there's another big line that's groceries. What kind Does of that target make sense? is this? E Target. This is the yeah. This is the weirdest target I've ever heard of. Well, the in between is where you would walk essentially. E Target. Kind of, e Target. Trying to make it make sense, but yeah, no, it's a good chunk of mine is toys. E Target. E Target. Probably All the not as around much here as have though. a. Have a like reasonably sized toy set. Yes, it's yeah. it's size. Com- like, yes, <laughs> in comparison to everything yes. else, it's like okay, this is the toy section. It's got the same size as what the baby section is, where you buy your baby. They actually cut down food. the baby section in our Target to add more toys. <laughs> anyway, we're talking about Toys R Us. So it, yes, so it, indeed, yes, there there are a group of toy makers that are looking to. Uh, buy as much of of Toys R Us as they can, so that includes the entire Canadian part and as up to four hundred U.S. stores. So who do you th- who like? I guess a like a conglomerate of toy companies. It says the company, the giant behind brands such as LOL Surprise, Little Tykes, and Bratz. Moose MGA Mo- Entertainment. Oh, okay. Moose? Why are you yelling Moose? Moose. Moose is another toy company that, that oh. makes like uh, they make Shopkins. I was confusing LOL with with, uh, and they also make the uh, the Nom Noms. Okay, I thought you were yeah. being attacked by a an a- wild animal for a second. <laughs> no, Moose is a big toy company. <laughs> or you were reading Archie comics while I was doing the show. One or the other. <laughs> it's a big toy company. I thought you meant Moose, okay. not MGA. I'm sorry that I got it wrong. And offended you so greatly. I'm not offended. Oh, and the, so the company also owes a lot of owes a lot of money to toy makers. Like they owe Mattel 136 million and Hasbro 59 million. That's a lot of money. Yeah. So I assume that's for buying stock inventory. I mean, you know. 
Uh, yeah, they just yeah. Themselves. I'm sure they just owe the money for. Yeah. Yeah. So yeah, that's sad news. Um, mm-hmm. I guess they're gonna we're gonna have a chance to get in on some of this sadness. I don't know. Yeah. I mean, it yeah. depends on what the yeah. timeline is for closure. If they do it anything like the uh, the Babies Are Us that they're closing by me, they started with a 30% off, and then it took a while to get to 40, and then I think last week they went down to 50. Well, they'll, they'll just go to the, with the liquidation company that does all of these. Yeah. I mean, it's it's not going to be great deals because they they take forever to go through the various cycles and people come in and buy stuff. Right. When it's 30% off. Right. Suckers. Everybody stay home. If we all get together and promise to wait for the 50% off, it's probably, yeah. it's probably going to be hard. Get some cheap Legos, I guess. No, those will be gone at 30%. Yeah. Well, I mean, you have to go when they're 30% off and get some discount Legos, I guess. Still cheaper than full price? I don't know. Hmm. Oh, well. It's sad. Yep. It is. It's very sad. My my son will not remember Toys R Us. No. Mine will probably keep asking to go for months after they close. What about Toys R Us? It doesn't exist. They're anymore. dead. What do you mean? What do you mean? You go to Target. Yeah. Don't mention that my name. Walmart has, my Walmart has a very small toy section. I wonder if they'll expand it when Toys R Us closes. I could see that being a possibility. The Walmart toy section is a little depressing, quite frankly. Yeah. You guys have different Walmarts than we do. Though. Yes, very different. That's what I was trying to explain before. Our targets and Walmarts are very different than yours. But uh, hmm. Our Walmarts go on for miles. <laughs> There's, there's only I, I, I was gonna say I don't even know how many WalMarts there are on Long Island. I know there's one by me. I honestly don't know where another one is. The, I'm sure there is another one. I just don't know where. There's one in uh, Westbury. Is there? Yeah, okay. right by uh, right by the Best Buy in Westbury, oh, right okay. next door. I take take your word for it. You can walk never to been. it from the other one. I've never been there. Yep. One time I walked to the Target, and when I walked back, there was a giant tractor trailer blocking my car in. That was nice. unloading. And the guy driving the truck was so enormous that you could see the whole truck move when he got in and out of the car, uh, the truck. And it was, you know, a tractor trailer. Anyway, he obviously... Did he say, did you, did you say excuse me, sir, do you mind rolling out? <laughs> no, I didn't say anything. I just sat in my car and shut the fuck up and just waited for him to move. And he did. And everything worked out fine. I got, thirty three thousand jobs is insane. That they're like I know it's that this mm-hmm. that's that's rough. So many people, and that's just Toys R Us. That's not even the fallout from all the toy companies that people are going to lose their jobs. True. Yikes! Like the like the the true heroes and Imaginarium and Animal Planet. Oh yeah, you're talking about the Toys R Us owned. Yeah, I'm I sure mean, those are all in that? China. All like, those jobs. I, there's still going to be offices in the United States where people are designing things and marketing and all that stuff. Sure. It sucks. Big time. Yeah. 